Hey everybody, I'm Rebecca Ryan. And I'm Libby Castro. We are the collaborators behind the Work Better Project. Um, we're here today with a very special message. Yes, um, just on the heels of saying goodbye to a dear friend, uh, another friend who is part of that group, <clears throat> excuse me, um, let us know that he also has uh, a stomach cancer. Um, fortunately, he is going to be just fine, um, but it reminded me that we really need to uh, think about other people and know that 99% of people are going through some stuff. You know, so it's important that we have some compassion around that. It's also important that we really think about, you know, what we're doing with our time and our day to day lives, say yes to things more often, you know, the things and, that really matter. Yeah. <laughs> and say no to the things that don't. That don't. No doubt. You know, uh, try not to waste energy and time on things that don't matter or also are, are really bringing you you down or other people down so that's our message for today yeah. and rebecca has some great yeah. things to say about it too so you know when libby and i started on this work better collaboration we really believed that work can be better it was broken before covid mm -hmm. covid showed really where the fractures were and that we have the ability to put it better um, to make it better, to put it back together in a better way. And when things like this happen with getting difficult news, mm -hmm. to me, it's just a reminder of a lot of people are suffering right now mm -hmm. and we may not know. And for many people who are suffering, work is the place they want to focus to stop thinking about the news, their family, their mm -hmm. illness, their kids' mental illness or difficulty. So how can we work better? Well, I think, you know, this is the point that we're trying to make is let's make work a place where people feel connected to each other mm -hmm. and where they feel connected to purpose. And work can be a great antidote to all of us who are going through difficulty, a place where we can focus um, that's not on our own suffering. So work doesn't have to be therapy. That's not what mm -hmm. we're saying here but work can be compassionate. So continue to be good to each other mm -hmm. and continue to work better. Amen. Well, this will be weird. Stop recording. <laughs> <laughs> no, well.